In-person voting is underway across Los Angeles. 118 voting stations have opened across the nation's largest county with more than 10 million people. And the Staples Center behind me is among the iconic venues in the city that will receive thousands of voters from now until the end of Election Day. And as you can see, these barriers have been put up in anticipation of long lines. This is actually our first time voting early. We actually always go the day of the elections. Um, but when we found out, we said this morning, we're going to head on over there. And there's not so much of a big crowd. We're going to take advantage of it. Because of the reason what's going on with the mail uh, post office and saying that the delays and then some of the mailboxes that were being removed. So that's the reason I, I try still not trust doing by mail. So um, I always done it physically. And this is, you know, the best way for me, I think. And personally, I, I think this is the best way. A number of COVID-19 safety measures are in place in order to prevent the spread of the coronavirus during the voting process. Voting booths are at least six feet apart and workers are using disinfectants after each time they're used. Masks, gloves and sanitizers are also available for those who need them. I am concerned. I'm a physician myself, so that's why I'm a little bit anxious about it too so i want to see first how it is before i enter and drop my ballot but that's why i got my n95 mask as well to make sure that it's safe for california voters voting by mail has been underway for several weeks now and while thousands of people have already mailed in their ballots others now have the option to cast those votes in one of these drop-off locations instead of mailing them if they choose to do so by october 30th Los Angeles will have all of the nearly 800 voting stations open to voters across the county. It is Tian Shan, CGTN, Los Angeles.